<clears throat> speaking of integrated um, uh, systems, uh, dispatch systems, we actually did have. This is a Chinese thing, or my or my China thing. We actually did have these. Um, you know, um, getting people to locations was always tough. So we had this project where where basically we were integrating the car with dispatch. So dispatch could just put in fourteen ninety two Baker Street. Car 32 or car 67 or car 77, go, click. And, um, and basically the, the, the information would be downloaded automatically or transferred automatically to the car to where, to where the driver can look at. So the driver knows where he's going, the police officer knows where he's going and what's happening there and can actually even be updated on the fly while he's driving or when he gets to the location like a small little explanation. We actually did a test thing like this and, and, the, and the initial test thing was a little bit too like blah, 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 blah. Like <laughs> it was like RoboCop basically. It was like, it's like RoboCop, you know, and stuff like that. Um, but basically, basically the general, what, what did hold over was, was basically the, 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 the integrated GPS system where the GPS tells the driver where to go. Of course, we always dream big and then we see what we can actually do. Um, but the next generation thing and what, the, what, what Japan and China actually did do, though, um, I actually spent a lot of money on this. We spent like $2 million for this exoskeleton suit, the alternate warrior. Basically, the, going along the same ideas of, of, of the police officer with, with, with sunglasses or basically like a helmet that basically gives the information of, of where he is, where he's going, you know, like an like a, like a on-screen display. where So you look and you see like the outline of a green outline of a map that's drawn with a laser or whatever. And they actually did it. Three million dollars, by the way. <sighs> or three million yen, pretty much. Pretty much. It was a very expensive suit. But basically, it's a... It, yeah, it's it's the one in the, in the future thing where it's this black helmet. It's got the thingy. Anyway, though, the laser displays will display a map on, on these... On, on the helmet. And also... Also, it'll also display, like... Um, also, they were working on also a targeting system where... Where you point and the and the little tracer follow tracks with the gun. The helmet actually tracks with the gun. So wherever you point, you know, um, you know your the little cursor. So so you know basically where the gun's probably going to shoot without actually even. So you can actually do like hip shots. Anyway, it was in China. China LS by the way, LS China. As you know, my my curved wheels, my cur my, my my wheels with the curved spokes. Or the S S spokes, basically in China. My printing press is in China, that kind of stuff. China, I have a huge investor into China, like like huge, huge. I mean, I I invested everywhere, Singapore, uh, China. I had a pro I had a project or program going or a project going almost anywhere, where, almost everywhere where where I'm paying this group, I'm paying that group, I'm paying this group. The cutting edge, most most high tech stuff. And they're working together. Anyway, though, but this exoskeleton suit, it's basically body armor. It's full-scale Kevlar body armor. Yeah, can stop any normal round and, and even some... They're working on the, on, on the, on the, uh, the armor-piercing bullets, though. We can stop normal, normal rounds, no problem. Like, it's a suit, basically, and it's made from super lightweight Kevlar or whatever. So it'll stop a normal bullet, depending on the size. Small 20... Some bullets it stops better than other bullets. Some they're working on it. You know, it's a, it's a three million or five million yen project where it's just like, uh, yeah, but it's really cool. <laughs> I was like, yeah, but it's cool. <laughs> it's like, yeah, but it's really friggin' cool. It was it was like the state of the art system where where dispatch is integrated into the helmet. Like the helmet hacks. The helmet actually has a built-in computer, or or it had a computer, a small computer here and this and a bigger computer on the back, and and so it. We were working on it. Anyway, it's a 3 million or 5 million yen. I was like, yeah, but I'm going to be the only one that has it. So it was actually really awesome. I mean, really, really awesome. Where it we're actually blew money like water. I mean, uh, I mean, 5 million yen or something like that. Or uh, It was a lot of money. But, but my Chinese, my, 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 my wonderful Asians were like, like I say, I love you, China. Like, like I want to say, I want to say Chinese and, and Japanese, I love you. I love... I love you. Like, like kiss you on the forehead, hug you, hold you, give you a handshake, just to say you guys really are. You guys really are. You're it. You're you're, you're the real thing. You know, a lot of other uh, other 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 races, a lot of other cultures. You know, they they pretend like they want to be high tech and all this other stuff. But 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 you guys, you guys did it. 
you know, thanks for having faith. You know, I love you. Um, anyway, though, I mean, Germany, Germany was, was behind me, too. Germany was like, yes, for the Fia, for the Lida, for the Lord. And, and you know, and, and great things came with them, too. And even Ireland. Ireland was, was really, like I say, the Irish, I'm always behind you. Yeah, I always got your back. And even the Aussies, which are, the Aussies are actually Irish that just moved. <laughs> so, so I got the Aussies back too. But, but anyway though, but, but, um, but yeah, I mean, I always, I always had the back of the, of the Irish. You know, like, like, like I say, one time the, the, the Irish were, were, were like, nobody believes us. Nobody will believe us. It's like, well, we'll find out. So, and I ended up giving the Irish a lot of guns and stuff like that because I did kind of, believe, I, I was like, well, we'll see. And you should defend yourself anyway. So I gave the Irish a lot of my, a lot of guns. <laughs> I, I, I helped them with, with some good weapons. I was like, well, you're going to need some good weapons. So, so somewhere in 1920 or some year, I gave the Irish some weapons so they could defend themselves. I said, it's only for defense, though. Not for going crazy and going, uh, going around shooting at everyone, because then, then, that, then that causes problems. But if you're going to defend yourself and you just don't want to be shot inside your house or inside your factory, then okay, you can have weapons. So I ended up giving them weapons and tanks, maybe. And some other stuff because it's like if it's for defense, if you're just defending your house, then yeah, I got your back. But you know, if you're just gonna go and and like raid a factory or or raid someone else's land, then no, I, you know, I'm gonna have to hunt you down or something like that. You know, or or you're gonna die. You know, you know, I, I don't help murderers or psychopaths. I only help people that just want to survive. So you know, that's what I did. So anyway, nobody would believe the Irish, and I was like, well, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. So I give them the, the, them the benefit of the doubt, and, um, well, anyway. Yeah, I guess they were able to live. I don't know. Anyway, though, but, uh, but the Super Soldier program, yes, integrated uh, uh, armor and everything else like that. I love that program. That was, like, my favorite program. I was, like, we spent a lot of money. It was, like, 2 million yen or 150 million yen. It was a lot of money, but, but I was, like, it's technology, though. I mean, you can't really go wrong with, with, with people practicing and, and making new things. I mean... No matter what, even it, even if it doesn't work for for the large scale, you know you've still created something new. You still created something high tech and modern day. Anyway, so yeah, you know I invested a huge amount of some money, and people were like, "You're crazy! You're crazy!" It's like, well, we'll have to see about that. You know, they're still working on it. And and like I say, I trusted the the, the Chinese and the Japanese. I knew that they would keep working on it, and they did. It was money well spent. The Japanese and Chinese were just like. We just pay wages. It's like, yeah, they were just paying their wages, you know, and, and they were building their building their civilization. They weren't they weren't stealing. They at least I don't think they stole. But anyway, there might have been some good times. But I mean, they did a lot of high tech technology. So anyway, so did Germany. Germany did a lot of stuff too. Um, they 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 taught Germany taught Japan and China how to how to do advanced stuff and how to do you know Germany showed. Told, told, told China or helped China as scientists. They, they, they did a teaching. We did a scientific teaching school for for China and Chinese and Orientals, so they could learn from from everything that that Germany knew, China knew. So to help upgrade into this thing. So and uh, and also Irish, of course. You know, schooling and knowledge is 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 is, is sh should be free. You know, you should be able to pursue your dreams and whatever. So anyway. And through it, I was able to pursue some of my own dreams. So, yeah, anyway, it was really cool. So, but but the super soldier program and the and and the full full enclosed wrapped body armor because I was kind of tired of losing police officers. You know, I lost a lot of sheriffs, and I didn't. I was tired of losing sheriffs from from some guy just going <laughs> and like <laughs> and then I lose another sheriff, and it's like <laughs> some little kid with a gun in five minutes, and now I lost I lost a thirty year old well trained sheriff that was honest. You know, so so I wanted to, so we created like body armor and all kinds of stuff, and and yeah, China's got it. It's the most advanced in the world. 